Gender stereotypes. They're everywhere in this world. They're most apparent in our media. Our media is actually perpetuating gender stereotypes. Let's look into a few examples. Commercials are a very common source of gender stereotypes. Many cleaning products such as air fresheners and paper towels show women as housewives. If you look into the paper towel commercials, you'll see that it's always a mother cleaning up after her children. Now what about men? Well, what do men like? Men like beer and meat and being strong. Keith Stone presents himself as the perfect manly man. Grilling meat, getting all the women, and drinking beer. Now let's look at Robin Thicke's music video. Now, if you haven't seen this, it's basically a video full of women dressed in, well, nothing. The way the women are presented in the video really objectifies them and shows them as a sex symbol. Now, this doesn't really help for the image of the woman. Parents and children's TV shows often show very stereotypical roles. For example, let's look at the cartoon Dexter's Laboratory. Look at his parents, his mother, dressed in an apron, wearing rubber gloves, always ready to clean or cook, and his dad, dressed in a suit all the time. Now let's keep in mind that these are the outfits the characters wear throughout the whole show. Now, if this doesn't scream gender stereotype, I don't know what does. Now let's look into a more popular film, The Avengers. Let's look at Black Widow. Notice how she's wearing the tightest outfit out of all the characters. And on top of that, they gave her the smallest weapon. I mean, a really? Everyone has powers, but all she has is a little gun? Is Black Widow really a hero, or is she just a sex symbol? Now what does this all mean for us? Well, now we're aware that our media is perpetuating gender stereotypes, and that's going to allow us to act now, make a difference. We won't be able to do anything immediate, but we'll be able to change the future. And that, I think, is very important in progressing our society.